Okay. Today I'm going to be messing with the About Blank page, and if you don't know what that is, it's that page that you see when, you know, you click on something and it's just blank. We do nothing, that's what About Blank is. Um, the funny thing about this is you can use it to basically just mess around with um, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Um, this page I made uses all three of those, um, and when I click this button, a symbol should appear. Yeah, so it's above, it's like above the picture, which I could fix, possibly. I could put it in a div, but, um, yeah, that's the point. Now, I'm going to basically do a tutorial on how to do all this stuff. Um, you can pretty much add anything you want to this. Um, let's say I can add an H1, um, funny website. Yeah. And what if I don't like this font? I can fix that. Add an HTML, add a CSS rule. Um, H1, um, font family. Um, what should I pick? There's only one answer to that. Is it not called Comic Sans MS? Isn't it called Fantasy or something? Oh, there it is, yeah. Um. And what if I want the text to be bigger? Well, guess what? I can change that. Um, font size. 32 point. That's better. What if I want this to be in the middle? Now I can do that too. Um, the text align rule. Center. Now, centering an image is a different story. That's harder to do. Funny website. Okay. Now I can... What else can I do? Um, I can add a... Just to make it look nicer. Add that. If, if, if you can't see it, it's a horizontal bar. Um, it's just, you know, decoration. Um, and then I can add, I guess, you know, add a subtitle. Um, and then in this, I can add a style. Just to be lazy with this. This is, this is a funny website. Yeah, it is, because I said so. Um, and what, what's funny without this? Now I'm probably thinking, hmm, how do I add a picture to a website? Well, you do this. Um, image source equals, insert the link, close it. And there's an image, but, hmm, it's not centered. Hmm, how would I fix that? Well, there's this really annoying workaround to that. And that's by using divs. Yeah. Um, they're it's really annoying workaround. It gets really repetitive, but it's not the only way. Centering a div is kind of an inside joke among programmers at this point. No, yeah, that's probably a style. I probably need style on that. Um. Then left. No. Uh, then margin. Right. It's also auto. And with. 
should be 50%. Percent. That should center it. And it did center it. But it's, it could be better. It could be smaller, actually. Um, and I think I know how to fix that. So I will fix wood. 100 pixels, that might fix it. Well, that's not going to fix it. I'm just going to leave it like that, because until I find another way to center a picture, I'm not messing with it. Okay. The sad thing is, the current HTML and CSS versions are basically running standards. Well, they could update them. Um... <clears throat> It could update put whoever's working for CSS. It would be a good thing to add a image, a line, um, tag. Now, hmm, now you're wondering, how would I go about making a button that makes an image pop up like I did? How you would do that is, I don't need that in the div, and I'm not putting it in the div. HTML. I'm gonna put a button and click. There's the button. Now it's not sending. It's not putting a picture on the site yet. Um. Now you've seen um. You know how I can actually make a better website than this with um, my uh, PGN video. Um. What well, what's an image I should put on here? Yeah, sure. Not exactly what I was looking for. Yeah. Um yeah, this. Um I can make this button turn into an image. Not turn into an image. Make an image come up. And how I do that is add image id equals funny source equals blank and you see, as you see there's still no image. That's because I want when I click this button the image to come up. And how do you do that? You go to the button and then there's a attribute called on click. And when you open this, it gives you the ability to write JavaScript. And what JavaScript is, is it's a programming language. I don't know if I explained that already. Then you do get element, element by id dot src. Wait, no. Um, the element by ID, and the ID is funny, dot src is equal to, open this, and then put that in there. And, that's how you, it's, it's not in a div, and it's not below it, so it's not going to generate below it, but it's there. And that's proof that I know stuff about website development um <clears throat> yeah uh, hmm. yeah that that's it for this video yeah i have 90 subscribers now so when i hit 100 i'll probably do something special i don't know what <clears throat> but um <clears throat> Yeah, um, most 200 subscribers, this video is about over with, and bye.